Temperatures are starting off around 70 degrees across central North Carolina, right at 70 in Smithfield with a mix of clouds and sunshine overhead. A beautiful sunrise here from Carter Friendly Stadium. Look at that. Sun officially comes up in just eight minutes, right at six o'clock for one more day. The sunrise times start getting later and later as we head through summertime, but still plenty of light. 69 degrees, the temperature at Carter Friendly Stadium. 71 degrees right now in Raleigh. Same temperature in Durham and Chapel Hill. There are some 60s on the map. Upper 60s right now in Cary and Apex. 66 degrees, Pittsburgh and Sanford. Also Creedmoor checking in at 66, some of the cool spots across central North Carolina. The warm spot is still close to 80 degrees. It's 78 right now in Grays Creek. Cumberland County, just a few degrees warmer, but the humidity is okay. It's not fantastic. It doesn't feel like fall out there. It's not going to until autumn actually arrives, but as long as we can keep the humidity in check, that's going to help us out a lot, including your furry friends. Chloe and Bella still seem content to hang out in the air conditioning, which is probably the right instinct. Thank you to Chris and Carrie for sharing their pups with us. That's just adorable. Temperatures are going to be hot once again. The humidity will still be tolerable throughout the day, but we're going to leave yellow paws in the forecast for this afternoon just because that pavement temperature is going to be well over 100 degrees with lots of sunshine overhead and air temperatures reaching up to around 90 but just partly cloudy skies all day and no chance of rain in the forecast yet today. Temperatures will warm up everywhere across central North Carolina. We'll be in the mid to upper 80s by lunchtime, right around 90 for highs in the triangle this afternoon, a little warmer to the south, a little cooler to the north. All these temperatures very close to what's normal for this time of year. Above average heat, though, is going to build into the forecast beginning tomorrow, and the humidity is going to start to creep back into the forecast tomorrow as well, which brings in a very slight chance of a pop-up shower on Thursday. But Futurecast just shows some clouds to Today, no rain in sight. Tonight, partly cloudy skies, and we'll see partly cloudy skies with lots of sunshine on Thursday. Blink and you'll miss it. A couple little blips showing up here and there on the radar simulation, but very few and far between. So we'll be generous and call it a 10% rain chance tomorrow. I think we're going to stay dry once again tomorrow. Temperatures will be hotter up into the low 90s. The humidity won't be dreadful yet, but it will be gradually increasing. It'll be back by Friday, and that means a chance for a pop-up storm or two Friday and Saturday with temperatures still in the low to mid 90s through the weekend. The best chance of spotty storms is going to be with a very weak little cold front trying to sneak in on Sunday. It's not going to have any cold air. It'll just drop us three degrees by Monday, but it will give us that 30% chance of a shower or thunderstorm Sunday. I wouldn't plan around it if you have any outdoor activities on the agenda. Just be flexible just in case. 554 right now.